Well, it has become Indian sports' biggest fall as two tennis legends bicker and fight, not willing to give up. The Aita in a late-night meeting on Tuesday failed to come up with a resolution to end the mud-slinging match between Leander Pace and Mahesh Bhupati. All eyes now on another meeting of the Aita today as it tries to break the deadlock and finalize the team for the Olympics. An Olympic-sized mess and a wrap from the sports ministry. Forcing the All India Tennis Association into a huddle on Tuesday evening. We have heard the remarks uh, and the views of the Honorable Minister as well as the Government of India, the IOA, and we are trying to see that the concerns of all the players are met and the, and the participation levels of the players are well looked after. Even as the AITA look for a solution, Mahesh Bhopati and Rohan Bopana seemed in a relaxed mood when your channel tracked down the duo at Wimbledon. While Mahesh and Bob skied on as if it was business as usual, it was a different story in Netherlands with Leander Pace still refusing to speak on record regarding the Olympic selection. We caught up with Leander, we met him and as you can see here from the footage, we spoke to him. But Leander did not want to come on record and speak to us about the whole situation. It's a developing story back in India and it seems like he's been advised not to speak to us. Back in India, a marathon 5-hour AITA meeting finally got over late in the night without any resolution. It is not an easy task for us to find an amicable solution. We are still working on it and hopefully by tomorrow evening we should be arrive at a a uh, reasonable solution which may not please everybody entirely but we are looking for a solution which can please most of them. The officials will once again sit on Wednesday afternoon and speak to Leander Pace, Mahesh Bhupati and Rohan Bopanna and according to the officials they will try to come up with the best possible solution which though might not be favourable to all the concerned parties. In New Delhi with Yogesh Radhika Tongar for Times Now.